What's going on? I'm Sebastian Telfair, and I'm here with a pro tip. And my pro tip today is how to split the pick and roll. The pick and roll is a big part of the game, and each and every team that you play for will play pick and roll and defend pick and roll. So today, I'm going to show you how to split the pick and roll. The foam roller being the guys that's on my team that's going to be setting the screen. Actually, come on, B. Smith. The foam roll is the guy that's setting the screen for me. B. Smith is the defender who's guarding the guy that's setting the screen for me. You will come in and out and throw the ball in between. This move right here is really unique. It gets the big out of the picture where the basket is really uh, clear for you. So a big man will be running over to set the screen. You'll be setting your guy up. You would like to get to the screen. I like to use an in and out for the defender because I'm not worrying about the guy that's guarding me because he's going to get hit by a screen. So once I get to the screen, I like to do an in and out where I get the big guy to go out and I throw the ball in between. Here's what it looked like in real action. And this move is really, really important because most of the time, if you're a point guard that have a lot of speed, you're going to get trapped off of the pick and roll. So if you can split the defender and your guy get hit by the screen, it opens up the entire floor. And when you guys are splitting the pick and roll, which is the move that we're working on right now, it's very, it's very important to watch the big man that's guarding the big man that's setting the screen for you. So as the big man run, run over to set the screen, at this point, you're watching the big man that's going to be helping on the screen. The big guy usually will show, trap you, whatever. I would like to get to the, to the defender and the in and out and get him off. Your man is going to get hit, so he's out of the picture. He can't even reach for the ball. You in and out him and go through. Let me show you guys one more time. So my guy's guarding me. I got him on my hip. I bring him to the screen, make sure he get hit by the screen. Then it's an in and out for the big, throw it through for a layup. And that's a pro tip that I have for you guys on splitting the screen and making your game a lot easier for yourself.